Our district, we're about 22,000 students, pre-K-12. We're urban, suburban, rural, almost 500 square miles. What I think is special about Richland One is the diversity that we have. We have a fantastic student body, dedicated educators, parents, stakeholders, partners. We do look to our entire community to help support educating our students and providing those options and opportunities so that our students can be the greatest person they can be. I am a proud product of Richland School District 1. I've known about Snyder all my life. As a student at Lorverson High School, Snyder is in my neighborhood. I met Justin Shutt uh, at a conference, and he started talking to me about savings and guaranteed. That led to a conversation that led to another conversation that led to a board decision to partner with Snyder Electric to help us better serve our students, our community, at a energy savings uh, level, and it's been it's been an amazing journey for us. Yeah, Richland One is a very unique school district. They were really in a, a very reactive position when we started this conversation. They were facing a mountain of deferred maintenance, and they were trying to come up with different strategies to tackle it piece by piece. We were able to bring them a solution where they were able to advance a number of different initiatives tackle all of this deferred maintenance in one comprehensive solution from mechanical systems, lighting, HVAC, building automation, water conservation, a district-wide telecommunications upgrade to a voice over internet protocol platform. First and foremost, addressing the $22 million of deferred maintenance that they were facing. We implemented plug load management and nine megawatts of solar power across 15 schools so that was rooftop solar as well as PV carports. So those facilities are actually generating as much power as they consume on an annual basis. They were able to sell power back to the grid at the same price that they were buying power, which is really incredible from a financial standpoint. To date, we've implemented almost $90 million in infrastructure improvements across 38 of their district's 52 schools. This is an award-winning project. They won South Carolina Energy Manager of the Year in 2021 with Mr. Miles Hanley, the district's energy manager. South Carolina Project of the Year in 2021 and 2023 and South Carolina Solar Champion from the South Carolina Solar Council in 2022. Lighting doesn't seem like a big deal until it's a big deal. Comfortable environment as far as HVAC doesn't seem like a big deal until it's not there. The ability to save money in operational costs so that those, those funds can eventually be used for instruction for students is a great opportunity. Normally when you're dealing with your funding you might only be able to affect one or two locations. Phase one of this, we were able to affect 15 schools and then take that out to the next couple of years. And we're looking at 38 schools that will have been positively impacted by the different things that we're able to do. Annually, our district is projected to save $3.4 million. The overall projected savings are close to $77 million over the next 20 years, potentially more with our solar panels. I'm pleased that other districts have reached out to us and, hey, how did you do that? I mean, provide some instructional and some educational exposure for our students in terms of STEM. And we see our students looking at things differently. Hey, I might want to go into that career or that field. So it's a win, win, win uh, uh, all the way around. I'm proud to say that Richland One is a partner with Snyder Electric, really am. And I know many would say that, you know, you're saving millions of dollars and that's a great part don't get me wrong but i think that the most impactful part is that we really can see that snyder cares about richland one and that's the part that that does my heart joy you know to know that it's not just a business relationship it's more of a family relationship they really have the best interests of our district at heart